TWT That's final. Crazy. So now it's like, okay, <laughs> what? I don't have to worry about TWT the rest of this tournament. I can loosen up. I can have fun mm -hmm. and maybe even try to win. So let's see what happens here. Saint doing pretty well. Best I think I've seen him play in a while. Yes. Wouldn't it be crazy if he gets like 19th place, right, in the standings, goes to the finals and then wins? He's like, yeah, I got the last spot, but all, it's all I need. I just needed to be here. I mean, if he wins, he like right? jumps up the standings a couple of points. No, I don't mean this time. I mean the finals. Oh. Yeah, dude. Like, that's crazy. Like, anyone can win it. All right, here we go, though. Kakoma off the Fantastic. They're back to go. Saint go with Bob. He's like, you know what? I qualified, baby. It's Bob time. I mean, do you really want to play the Jack into Paul, especially the way Kakoma's been playing today? Yeah, the way, I mean, Anakin's had it rough against Paul, too. Yeah, he managed to clinch it out against Kakoma in the first round of winners, but that was weird. Mm -hmm. Whips completely, but gets off. Hey, hey. Man, Kakoma looks like he was so prepared for the Bob matchup. Hey, hey, hey. Breaks the throw. Using the jab, breaks the throw again. That good Bob jab. <laughs> <laughs> Tried to chase him down, but... This is cool, though. I like seeing safe play Bob. Using that classic outfit, too. Oh, I know, right? This gives me T6 vibes. I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> you'll see a down one, and you'll just start going into shell shock. <laughs> oh, oh, what is God. everybody doing? It works out this time, though. This might be enough to kill. I think it's going to be darn close. It's enough. Clutch Rage Art from Saint. It's big boy season. It's getting cold out. You need all that layers of insulation. Mm -hmm. Yo, the bomb. Hey, hey. The punish. The classic Bob outfit is pretty good. I like yeah, right? it. That'll be four dollars. Come up with a good life lead here, but Saint with Rage. Saint Rage, I mean, Bob Rage Drive, not the best, no. but doesn't even get a chance to use it. That Hell Sweep gets scouted and blocked. Man, Kakoma's defense has been so sharp. Yeah. We haven't seen a lot of the sidewalk and the standing 3 2 out of Kakoma. No. Saint's trying not to give him a chance to get that far around to his back. But a bad 4-4-2. Wow. I don't even need to get to Damn the back. Girl. I don't even need to get to the back to get the Sway 1 plus 2. I'm just going to do it right in your face. Wow. And it's so... I had a random thought just now. It's so weird. Like, is Kakoma the first Korean player to not play on a Korean lever in <laughs> tournament? <laughs> no. Uh, Kudan, when he had a hand injury, played on pad and won electric cancel 6.5. Okay. Yeah. He won the damn tournament on pad. With Mishima still. Okay. It's pretty good, that Kudas guy. Shout out to Kudas. We're having a good day out wherever you're at. It just struck, it, it just came out to me. It's just so odd. No, it is. It's very odd. Especially uh, currently, right? Just give it like a one more there year. Is, um, uh, there was, uh, I think, a, a player from Japan, actually, who was playing in pad in sure, like top so. eight of Evo the other year. I can't remember his name. Chiri Chiri. Yes. So yes. they're, you know, they're definitely well, Japanese just specifically, players. Yeah, just specifically in Korea. I was like, yeah. oh, give, it, give it like six months to a year. I'm sure they'll, they'll just all be hitbox players. Nah. nah. Or cross-up players. Nah. It's going to be G bad. Give me a cross-up. We're going to ban the cross-up. <laughs> well, I said we, but like I have no like powers to enforce yeah. that. But we're going to ban the cross-up. Just give me a cross-up with a Korean lever. I said it louder. I hope they heard me. Make the cross-up. With a Korean lever? Yeah, yeah. Let me, let oh, me, let me throw a crown. Come on, man. Or I want CDP two joysticks on my controller yeah, let too. Just, let me just put a CDP two in there. Two joysticks on it too. I'll put a what? A CD player in it? No, it's a crazy dunk ball level. Oh, okay. CDP. Oh, the sway uh -huh. left. Same going with the jack. Figures he might have to just deal with playing into the bad matchup. Wow. Yeah, I mean that the bot pick did not work out for him. Yeah. He got around with the clutch rage up, but really that was kind of a lucky. Yeah, play but. For him. Tekken is definitely one of those games where even though, you know, people say bad matchups don't exist, that's not entirely true for Tekken. For Tekken. Mm -hmm. But player skill can definitely overcome those matchup issues. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. Yeah, Tekken is very rarely a, truly a bad matchup game. Like, what's the worst matchup you've ever seen in Tekken? Character matchup. Akuma versus Akuma. <laughs> what? <laughs> 
Oh god, I love that wild standing forward there. It was about to get real ugly otherwise. Fight. And man, the Jack being way better. Way better. His yeah. Jack was looking so good all day today. Yeah, and he decided to go with the Bob. Maybe decided, hey, Anakin won this one. I should be, I should be able to win this matchup too. Wow, just a dash up down forward to catch Kakoma. Doesn't get a combo to close down. Okay, ball with rage. Don't go away from his wall. Such a quick three rounds right there. Mm -hmm. Kakoma yeah, looking at like, this guy. Yeah, I feel like Sink was one of those demons. You know, I mentioned earlier, Kakoma, he's one of those Koreans that has not really won a lot of these master level events, right? Has he even won one? Which one do you win? Do you uh, remember? It was one of the European ones. It wasn't the mix up. It was a master event? It was a master event. Because I, I definitely checked his points before, and he's, he's got totally going away. So. Oh, it can only mean Kazumi's coming out. Or, or maybe Dragunov. Dragunov. Yeah. Dragunov would be crazy because of the how much experience Saint has in that matchup with Jack. Yeah. So I would expect to see Kazumi here. But, you know, whichever tournament he won, it's still very rare to see him. And I feel like he hasn't won a tournament where all the killers are there. You know, he usually loses to, like, a knee, a JDCR, or a Saint, or something, you know? And so, yeah. like, winning here over Saint would be huge for him. As a confidence booster, even. I mean, to be fair, I mean, the Saints in 19th place, and I think he's there because he, too, hasn't really won a big event. This he's year. Won, yeah. yeah. But it's just a, I guess it's a testament to how the, the system worked this year. It's like, you don't necessarily have to win as long as you have, like, relatively strong performances across the board. Exactly. And it's interesting seeing, like, the different players from different regions, where their points came from. Some of them just got a big Masters win, and that's what boosted them all the top. Mm -hmm. Some of them have a lot of good dojos. Yep. Some of them have challenger events that they won. It's just, like, different mixes You s tells kind of the story of how they may managed to qualify for the finals. But I wonder if somebody can do the math to see who the biggest gatekeeper was. Like, who went unnecessarily to way more events than they needed to and gathered a bunch of points that took away from everyone else? Me. Me? Nee? Yeah, because he's at the top, right? But Nee, I think but I don't know nee if he qualified one. early I and he like still kept going to events. I don't know. I feel like it might be JDCR. Maybe JDCR. Because he went a ton of challenger events. Yeah, maybe like, JDCR, maybe Olsan. I think Olsan went to way more than he had to. Okay. It's an interesting Low standard. High. Low High is the biggest gatekeeper. Oh, probably. Like, oh, I definitely went everywhere. But anyway, yeah. while we've been talking about this, Kakoma the brings up the Kazumi. Yeah, drop it on him. The. I just look at this one, I think Princess Leia. I don't know what's happening over here. This, this is distracting. This costume is weird. It's very distracting. It's very shiny. Jack would probably like shiny things. Jack Hammer, these guys trading blows up close. Flash punch combo, pushes back towards the wall. Saint trying to seem trying to scoot away from that wall, but wow, just finishes twin pitch and then the down three will close out the round. Kakoma first round here, final game. Two. Fight. First to two here since we just didn't lose a semifinal. You know, no, no duck. Kazumi's a pretty solid character overall. She's really good at playing the small game with Saint, but you see when Saint whipped that down for a two, this one is connecting, he's gonna get to the wall. The problem one of the problems with Kazumi is that from that range, she doesn't have a strong with Punisher, that's a combo starter. All she's really doing right. is maybe like a 3-2 or a 4-4-2. Four, four, uh -huh. Maybe if you're super on point, you get Tiger Uppercut. Sure. But. Yeah, you have to be really on point to hit the Tiger Uppercut as a whip punish. Uh, Hop Knee steps forward, but still not the best hitbox on it either. It's so bad. But Kakoma with a good lead in the second round. Sane wants that low parry again. Oh, he could have punished him. Maybe one off that. Oh, boy. Nice flash punch combo, set point for a Kakoma here. I feel like this is the first time he's brought the Kazumi Fight. today. I don't know if that's right. Might be though. I think he might have brought it out yesterday. Though. Yeah, I think you're right. So they're like, Oof. Oh, but Saint gets the oh, throw this God. time. No block on the punch. Okay, yeah, gave him a chance to block it too. Oh, man, Saint coming out swinging now. Look at this, he's gonna turn it around. Gets All on the right. board. Yeah, I know. I, I think he's going final, final. I can, I can sense these things. You are a master of the craft, so I believe you. Low oh, parry from Saint. Saint's trying to make your prediction come true. Back two. Sidestep two. Back two. Oh my goodness, the hop. Get thing. off me! I'm tired of those back twos. Where's his wall at? He found it. Side wall splat though. Oh god, the pressure. Kakoma keeps it close. Close range like this, I think he has a much better chance. 
Fly one plus two, trying to get plus frames. Stands in big punch. trouble. Does it finish it? What the hell? The oh. power crush. I told you it wasn't gonna happen. Got him. Kakoma. Why did I ever doubt you? To top three. Kakoma Ooh. makes top three. Saint is gonna leave the tournament at fourth place, but he knows that he has. Again, as we talked about before, he has clinched the yes. finals for himself, so he's got that weight off his shoulders. I know, such a test him. He had to, he had to go through the entire tournament to get to this point. Don't forget, Saint lost early in the tournament to his yes. loser bracket forever. And he, but he there, made it here. There were, there were five, six, seven players that had a potential to take his spot, and oh, now yeah. they're all gone. It's so like he's fine. It was like everybody who could have lost his spot all went to the loser bracket. Yeah. Like, like, what? What just happened? Except yeah. for Jimmy, right? So. Shout out to Sand getting fourth place here, but Kakoma moving on to the top three. 